Hey everyone, just wanted to show you that um, I finally bought an Oxygenetics um, shower head, body spa. And I'm going to be doing the unwrapping here shortly. I'm going to begin to install this and hopefully it will do what it says it does. It's supposed to have a smart pause valve, it's supposed to have some good pressure, and uh, it's supposed to save water. So let's see. make it so hard to get into. So it comes with the the stop valve here. That looks nice. It's cool. And then it's got the mount. Um, apparently, you can use double-sided tape, sticky tape for that for the wall. And then it comes with the tubing. Interestingly enough, this is what the tubing looks like on my shower. So. Maybe it shouldn't be so bad after all. I'm a little anxious about taking that off on mine. And I'll show you why in just a second. Shower head itself. And it's made in China. <laughs> Isn't everything made in China? So I don't know, this looks, it looks like it's pretty easy to do, I suspect. I should probably, I'm not good at reading directions, so. I think I said that on a previous video, but I will read the directions, I promise, because I don't want to mess it up and end up not being able to take a shower. So, anyway. Uh, actually, interestingly enough, oh, here's the directions. I was say, I didn't see any directions, but maybe this is it. That's just the wall mount. Uh, here's the directions. directions. I don't know if for any of you who've watched uh, my videos, Pippi Peterson was giving one away and I entered her contest and unfortunately I didn't win it. I've always wanted one since then so I'm really glad I got it this time. So um, I'm real anxious to see how this is going to work on my particular situation. So I'm going to have to YouTube my, uh, my connection so I can go ahead and make sure I do it the right way without destroying anything because with my luck I tend to break things so huh. all right so once I get ready to install I'll take you along okay so here is my shower setting here's the faucets which are, I think are pretty standard but then the connection piece here I don't know if I could just twist that and take it off or if I oh oh maybe Maybe I can. I'll be darned. Let's see. Guess I better move everything out of the way. I'll be darned. There you go. All right, so I guess I can install this pretty quickly. Okay, so I have the shower head here. And this is the old one, which I am disconnecting. Turn it down there for now. And then I've got the tube, which should just screw right in here. That's gone really easy. This is a little too simple. And we're gonna go ahead and put the shower head in. Well, I guess we should see if it's gonna work because that's what I want to know. Well, it works a lot better than the shower head I had. I'm not certain I'm as thrilled with it as I thought I would be. But 
That looks too bad. Shutter oh. back on. Not too bad. Alright, now that I'm totally wet. I think I like it. Okay, so I just wanted to finish up this video and let you know I did put in the the shower hall, um, holder. Um, it went in pretty easily. The I didn't really like this. Don't tighten that up too tight because you'll crack it. It's very, very flimsy. And they have um, double-sided sticky tape up here that holds this portion up. The only problem is, is that it moves around a lot. And, and in this, you can untighten it and you can position the shower how you want it um, and that works okay I'm not I'm not necessarily thrilled that it. it's kind of it's for the price it seems kind of chintzy and cheap but um, I'm finishing the video a few days after the initial install and I have to tell you that I, I do like the shower a great deal it, it's much better than what I had and um, it was really an easy install actually far easier for me than I thought it would be so if you're considering an oxygenic shower head, I would say do it. It's great. It's a lot better than uh, the regular RV showers that you get. So thanks so much for watching. Thumbs up if you liked the video. Don't forget to share and subscribe. If you're not a subscriber to my channel, please definitely subscribe. All right, everybody. Have a great day.